New on Daybreak, some local high school students are helping firefighters figure out the most efficient search and rescue techniques. The students are working with several departments over their spring break to collect data during training. And News 8's Nina Criscolo attended too. Sounds like a very helpful partnership. Yes, absolutely. It's so interesting too. This collaboration was sparked by the Washington Township Avon Fire Department. You can see the house looks to be filled with smoke, but it's actually a fog machine causing zero visibility. Firefighters from several departments Departments in Hendricks County and shifts then have to find the victims, in this case, training dummies inside the home by entering and exiting the home in different ways. What you may not expect is Avon High School students timing them both outside and inside the home to collect data on the training. Amanda Leahy is the AP statistics teacher at Avon High School, and she says this partnership allows a really unique chance for the students to gather real life data instead of just solving problems from a textbook. The course of doing the mathematics is not really straightforward. So when we get back from spring break, we're going to have an opportunity in the class to say, here's all this data. Um, now tell me what you can do with it. And, and for the kids to be able to explore some raw data that's not guided for them, that they have to make the decisions about what can be analyzed and what can be. And that's exciting for me as a teacher to give them the opportunity to explore um, in, with real life stuff. The training continues this week and next as spring break continues for Avon students. It's happening on Vestal Road, just south of County Road 200 South, just so you know if you happen to travel through that area. And on top of this being a good opportunity for the students and a way for the fire departments to get real analytics about what they do during emergencies, the students yesterday told me it's really opened their eyes when it comes to fire safety as well. We'll hear more about that in our next hour of Daybreak. Oh, that's awesome. We look forward to it, Nina. Thank you.